The People's Democratic Party, Kaduna State's chapter, has called on the State Electoral Independent Commission to ensure free, fair and credible polls by giving maximum concentration to the forthcoming local government chairmanship and councillorship election slated for June 2021. PDP Secretary Ibrahim Ulusonu says the party has agreed to participate in the forthcoming election following the promise given to them by the Commission to conduct free, fair and credible election across the all 23 local government areas of the state. We agree to participate in this election because they promise they will provide, they will conduct free, fair and credible election. And with that promise they made, that is what makes PDP to agree to participate in this election. So without the conduct of free and fair election, we will not even participate. But since they made promise, we are appealing to them to ensure or to make sure that they fulfill this promise. Secondly, I'm appealing to our the members of our political party, that is PDP, to make sure they vote the right person, the right candidate that will represent our party in the forthcoming local government election. Because the good candidate, the better candidate we produce, it will determine how successful it will be during this local government election. So I'm sure, even by looking at those that are uh, both the forms, uh, at least when you look at the candidate, I'm sure we have better people to contest in this election. So, but I'm, I'm sure I'm, I'm appealing to the members of the party to make it happen, to produce a better candidate who will represent our party during this uh, contest with other political parties. He called on the people in the state to come out in mass to exercise their franchise as a citizen of the country by voting the right candidate that will rule them in various levels of leadership in Kaduna. He also warned youth against violence and toggery. The basic role or principle of any government is to protect the life and property of its citizens. But in Kaduna state or in Nigeria now, there is no security. Nobody is safe. Once you came out, you don't have the belief that you will go, you will go back home safe. Anything could happen to you. Why, if the government can do what it's supposed to do, can protect the life of its citizens? People rely and agree with them that they will. They promise to provide it within three within three months. President Buhari promised to provide adequate security, adequate security in, within Nigeria. But what is now here, over seven, almost seven years now, instead of the security uh, problems to reduce, it has increased more than 100%. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.